सो हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू अनदर वीडियो ऑफ डेवलप विथ ऐप स्क्रिप्ट एंड ऐप शीट चैलेंज लैब सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल क्लिक ऑन स्टार्ट लैब नाउ हियर ओपन ऐप शीट इन कॉग्निटो विंडो एंड आल्सो ओपन क्लाउड कंसोल इन कॉग्निटो विंडो फर्स्ट ओपन क्लाउड कंसोल बिकॉज़ इन की सम टाइम्स इट क्रिएट साइन इन ऑटोमेटिकली विदाउट एनी यूजर नेम एंड पासवर्ड सो नाउ वी विल ओपन द ऐप शीट url for signing in so now click on i understand for this now let's move forward to the lab instruction again and from here right click on the open maintenance app and here we have to create the copy of it and rename it so wait click on copy this button enables copying the app so make sure to sign in using google now as you were signed automatic signed in automatically via console in case he it's our username and password you can enter the lab instructions username and password now click on allow now here you have to use this name that is at maintenance tracker so now again click on copy app click on copy app now click on the crowd console and agree and continue now let's move forward to the github repo once again so we will be moving towards task number 2 so first of all after creating the app now we have to open the drive and export some files so for that just right click here and you need to download this file on your local system just right click the file and download it simply download it to your local system that means in a drive or just downloads folder now, now from here the drive click on open drive so once you click open drive now click on data and then at maintenance from here click on tickets so as you can see we have opened the ticket unwanted pop up now click on files then click on import and from here upload the file which it has downloaded from the github repo so this is the file dear avishek so now you have to export the file click on replace spreadsheet make sure to click on replace spreadsheet now, after replacing now, the spreadsheet the we lab. are done with the both the tasks and now we will be moving forward to the last task so let's see as you can see we got a score for the two task now last task is very much easy but sometimes most of you may face a necessary error so make sure to follow as i am doing so from here right click on open app script you can close the remaining windows that is of drive and sheet now from here we have to click on rename the project name so first of all rename the project name as you can see we have re renamed the project name now enter this code make sure to copy carefully enter the code now we have to enable some important setting so first of all right click here now click on save now click on project settings first of all wait for this one to open follow all steps meanwhile in case you haven't liked the video like it and do subscribe the channel for more such amazing content get started now here for the app name you can refer to the repo or just lab instruction so enter the name select the username click on next the app type is internal click on next and then take the email from the lab instructions so as you can see the lab email is here all things we did are same as the github repo so i have made the repo for your easy and convenience only so now enter the contact information i agree and then 
finish. So after that, you need to do some changes. Copy the project number from here. Click on project settings. Now here, click on change project. Enter the number and click on set project. So most of you guys may face the bot is not responding. So you have to make sure you have changed this project number here. So now we will configure the chat API. So open in incognito window. Now here, please pay attention to it because this task is little bit tricky. The name from the GitHub repo and for the URL enter this. Now for the description enter helper chatbot. Now click on receive one to one messages join species and from here select deployment ID. So now enter the username. Let's move forward to the tasks. As you can see, make sure to export the correct deployment ID. We have to export head deployment ID, not any other test deployment ID. So click on deployment, test deployment. And as you can see, here are two deployment ID. Don't export this one. Always export this one. That is head deployment ID. So now copy it. Now move to that page and now as you can see all things are correct make sure to cross verify everything and then click on save now we have to do one more thing wait for it so as you can see it got saved now reload the window now it will show something unique so wait the app status is showing live to all users now you have to click on save after reloading this page when you have configured all file names emails app ids everything so now we are on the last stage just open the chat so finally just the open chat the is open. chat and type any message now click on so start chat now from here type helper click again new chat in case you want helper so just select this as you can see we got a adding notification so write any message cross this unwanted pop-up write any messages and then hit enter now we are done with the lab guys let's check my progress as you can see we got full score without any issue i hope you guys like the video do like share and subscribe the channel